This is the Paranology's gyroscope. It is a digital talking board that's controlled by static fields. When you first get the gyroscope, you want to turn it on. It's going to calibrate itself by turning in the counterclockwise position. These are actual light bulbs, and uh, you'll see that it just detected my static. So those are controlled by static electricity. The tungsten inside the light bulb is actually the antenna, and they are removable and covered by the Paranology's lifetime warranty. What we're going to do is as soon as this turns clockwise, just like so, that means it's ready and calibrated. I'm going to charge myself up. I'm going to stop this dial right here. So you can see it's detecting my static right there on the maybe. There's yes, no, and maybe. I'm going to leave it illuminated. And I'm going to set off the other side on the alphabet. You can see it's detecting the D. So what you want to do is you want to get communication. You want to ask, can you touch one of the light bulbs and set off a letter? And then you want to tell them what letter it is. That way uh, you, they can kind of learn how to use it. Also, it has glow-in-the-dark filament, so when I do yes or no, it has a UV light under it, and you'll notice if I remove the light, you can see it in glow-in-the-dark. So when you're sitting in the dark, you'll be able to see your responses no problem. And I like to jot down the letters when it goes off. Now, when you're using this, you, wanna, you don't want to sit too close because it can detect a person. You want to make sure that all fans and anything, anything that can create a static field um, are not going. If you notice that it's hitting a letter over and over, you need to turn it off and let it recalibrate because there's something in the room causing a static field. I've had uh, great success with this, and uh, if you have any more questions, please go to paranologies at yahoo.com. And if you want to remove the antennas, you can. It's just a light bulb, like I said, and that'll make it less sensitive. I like to use the antennas, but sometimes if it's very dry out, um, it will be very, very sensitive. You, gotta, you wanna stand back. Humidity actually kills static fields. So if it's very humid out, you may not get any responses. Uh, it's very dependent upon humidity. But um, this is a great item. And if you would, uh, like I said, if you need any other questions, please contact paranologies at yahoo.com.